Alright, time to go die. Um. Is that intentional? Yes. Oh. I told you, I'm gonna die. There's treasure here, too. Nicholas I assume likes... I assume you mean before the fight. Nicholas likes to uh, organize his Pokemon boxes by number. Yep. Yep, he do. And uh, it's I don't know. It's just super satisfying to me. Just on uh, on playthroughs when I'm deciding to do a living dex. Which is, like, usually one per generation. Jordan says it's in a tree again. Yeah, I figured. I, uh, and I happen to be pointing at that exact tree. Gold bagel with pearls. Did you say bagel? I did. On purpose? Yes. Hmm. I got that from Dovey. Uh. Alright. Let's see how many tries this fight's gonna take. Okay, it's just, uh, just controlling with the stick. Good to know. And... Do you have unlimited harpoons? Yes. Secret Aquarium just got randomized to Secret Aquarium. Very nice. Pokemon Stadium made it easy to do mass box organizing. I didn't know Pokemon Stadium had box organizing. I just... I never bothered with, uh, with living decks... In, uh, in Gens 1 and 2, because that's it, it's just a giant pain in the ass. Because the box system in those games is atrocious. I'm making a terrible face of this giant horrifying fish. Giant horrifying fish! Well, that reminds me, I was gonna make myself a tea in my horrifying new mug. Oh, that was a horrible throw. And guess what? I don't think that's what? what you're supposed to do. I wasn't supposed to throw my harpoon at the thing. I don't think you're supposed to hit the tree thing and die. Yeah, I keep I forget I I forgot I could steer while I'm on this. Or like while I'm being dragged by the Del Lago. Whee! Sorry, Wanton, did I disturb your napping? A lot of okay. Blood. It's a big creature. Dip. Leon, Leon. Have you tried doing this like Jonah and the Big Whale style? Where you just like enter its digestive tract and go from the inside? Uh, gotta say, I would rather not. Uh, where is? There is. Why am I? Why am I still in the throw the thing? It's that way! It's that way! It's further that way! I missed, somehow. There are a lot of people screaming Among Us right now in the recommended channel section. Shocking. Uh, that was a bad throw! Gotta remember, like... What, the, the After a throw, it, like, defaults to where you last threw. What, the, the trying to do it from the inside out style? Yeah, that does sound pretty horrible. Oh, God, swim for your life! That's not how human bodies work, Leon. Also, you might want to do it. I'm getting to that. Eventually. I sure did. Missed again. Wow. I am so bad at this game. So you can be says Ripnik's GameCube controller. This is all your fault, Jordan. Badong! Badong! I am so glad I have unlimited harpoons. Which, by the way, the icon on the HUD there looks like a sword. Totally does. Whoa! Uh, 
uh, Kite wishes that there would be a Switch version of Pokemon Stadium that can connect to the DC versions. Can the Switch connect to the 3DS? Like, in any way? Oh, Jordan says, what did I do? Uh, you got the frickin' Mario Brothers 3 slash New Super Mario Brothers, uh, song stuck in your head- in her head. And I keep singing it, so, uh, Camera! stuck in Nick's head. <laughs> she says that the only way for 3DS and Switch Connect that she's aware of is for Pokemon Home. Mmm. Mmm, yeah. One says, <laughs> Ah! God damn, this fight sucks! Look after you decide to do I'm dead. Aw. Of course, you took that long. Thanks. Thanks for your confidence. It's a large fish with very sharp teeth. Uh huh. It's terrifying. And I have unlimited harpoons that I can't aim for shit. Oh. I'm being stared at. But yeah, I'm kind of surprised they haven't made another uh, another Pokemon Stadium game. Jordan says you gotta maneuver the boat. How am I supposed to maneuver the boat when it's not moving? <sighs> yes? Hello. Do you require anything from the land of Stand? Uh... I don't think so. Cool. I'm off to go and feed a cat. Have fun. I have both Pokemon Stadiums. Haven't haven't touched the second one yet. Seriously? Seriously. I have. You were with me when I got it. Yes. I know I can swerve out of the way of the shrapnel. That's not what I'm having issue with. I've only run into the shrapnel one times. That was the one times. Oh, come on! Where is he? Where was he? Um, you can swerve away from the fish too? How? The boat is stationary. of that miss. How did that one not miss? Uh, you can swerve away from the fish, too. I saw that, yes. When he jumps towards you, you can still steer. Also, hi, I'm back. Welcome. Can you, can you pick up a harpoon, please? I agree with the statement of uh, Pokemon Stadium 2 being horrendously overpriced. Yeah, honestly, we got a, I got my copy for relatively cheap. I don't even remember how much you got it for. It was like... 40? Oh god, where is he? There, there, there. I see him. Oh, that was a bad throw. Ugh! Mm. 
It's like all the copies of the uh, 007 GoldenEye that I see at our local uh, used game store. I did not think GoldenEye was a particularly expensive game. Well, because they just go with whatever they see as the highest price on eBay. Yeah, specifically the highest price. How did that still hit me? I got my copy of Stadium 2 back in 2013 for like 20 bucks, says Andrew. Nice! 20 American dollars. Which is basically a thousand. Rule number one of being of being Canadian. Always make fun of your own currency. I've only ever seen it marked at like There we go! Fifty dollars or higher at our local used game store. I also wish N64 games weren't so expensive. Also, and just games, GameCube games. Especially GameCube games. Oh right, I forgot about this shit. Oh yeah, now you get to, to water ski, right? No, now I just get to stab myself in the leg a few times. Seems legit. Auto-modulate sending that me uh, message for some reason, speaking of GameCube. Yeah, I know, I, I don't get why it does that sometimes. Yay, dead fish! Woo! Sikapi got Chibi Robo last year for about 40 bucks. That's hella cheap from what I've seen online. Wonton, I refilled your nip toy. Have a hat. That's, that's one of the GameCube games that I've been, like, semi-actively searching for, for a decent price on. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's not great in terms of pricing. Uh, I've heard the game itself is very good. I just tend to check on uh, Amazon and eBay, etc. around uh, gift-giving seasons for you for various Persona games. Fair. I honestly don't know what you all have in your collection. <laughs> uh, the only mainline one I don't have is uh, 2 Eternal Punishment, which is uh, the one that we saw at 8-bit for like 180 bucks. <laughs> so that's th I'm, I'm going to be getting that one on PS3, uh, the PS1 Classic version. Uh, Sikibi says, Nick, would you be open to me lending you my copy? And Andrew says, I saw Chibi Robo for like 70 at Magfest. Uh, that's, uh, that, that's a maybe? On that, on that one there, Diane? Do you not trust her with, uh, her address? I do. Remember that time we sent Brian a thing? And we were not subtle about getting his address? Nope. The Pidgeotto? Yeah. Yeah. Saw a copy of Harvest Moon 64 at a store yesterday, but I didn't see the price, but it was at least 60 bucks, probably. Yeesh. Don't tell John I didn't get it. Okay, I won't. I won't remember this conversation, because I have a terrible memory. Leon, it's you okay, been six bro? hours since our last transmission. I was starting to get worried. I was starting to get worried. Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and uh, I'm at I so I lost consciousness. Also, yes, lost Jordan, 15 deaths. Maybe that has some connection to what the village. Ten of which were in. Hmm. Can't say. Ten of there. which were in one one. Continue my mission. Mostly due to decapitation. Mm hmm. Can confirm. Was there. Yep. Uh, anonymous letter. El Gigante. Yeah, the El Gigante is going to be uh, quite the time. Free flash grenade. I think Wonton's losing weight. His hips look skinnier. Well, they don't lie. My god. I'm sorry, was that uh, too low hanging of fruit? Maybe. Kick. At least you're not making or er, telling me off for, for fat shaming the cat this time. Yeah, stop cat shaming. Uh, 
Can't help but notice that I'm still, like, close to death. And I, uh, I don't appreciate that much. How dare the game not heal you? I rested, sort of. I passed out. That doesn't really count, but, uh, you know. Hey, look. It's a man who wants to sell you stuff. Got some rap! That's it. That's that's the entire sentence. <laughs> do, 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 do. I can climb. Kite says that he's been playing Hyper Dimension Neptunia V2 on the Switch lately. Nice, I've nice. never heard of that game. Then again, I haven't heard of a lot of games. Same. I'm just like, heck yeah, Animal Crossing! <laughs> Ooh, a green game. I do believe that goes into our mask Stick of says, elegance. Got some rare Super Baby Mario 2020. That is a thing I said. What's up? Apparently he doesn't have some rare. I lied. Wanting? Hey, Wonton. I can upgrade old? Riffle some more. Is what are you old? getting into, <laughs> bud? Thank you. What are you selling? And we can sell... Bunch of ammo. Excuse me. Sell the ammo. Is that all? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, we've got some Spinellis or <laughs> a Spinelli. <laughs> Thank you. Ah. Ah. Buy it at a high price. Got a selection of good. What are you buying? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Ah. I'll buy it at a high price. <laughs> Thank you. Cool you out. Uh, what are you buying? What else have you got? I probably should pick up an amount of first aid sprays. End of sentence. Uh, oh, I can also sell some frickin' shotgun shells as well. Oh, I see. You were in the closet. Um... Gonna move a couple things around a bit because I'm suddenly annoyed at things. Suddenly? Suddenly. There, now we're good. OCD time. I think that's just called time. Question. Answer. How has your job changed since we got the sortie machine? I... I've done a lot more sitting. Yay? Yay. Uh, um, what are you sell selling? some shotgun shells. Is that all? <laughs> Thank yes, that you. is all. Also, Jordan, I saw you today whilst you were at work, but I had headphones in and you looked very busy, so I did not interrupt you. I, uh, I see the cat as being a cat. Yeah. My or may not have gotten him super high. That's never happened before. Mm. No sorry, never He's, ever. He sleeps through the night when I get him super high. Does he not normally? No. That's unfortunate. No, oh, he usually wakes me up at 4 a.m. or so, scratching at the door. You wouldn't know because you're usually conked right out. I sometimes wake up with the door scratching. It's unpleasant. Jordan says that today was a pretty busy day for like the first five hours. And then nothing afterwards? But how's tomorrow going to be? You'll have uh, John and Suzanne at 6 a.m. Well, John will be there at 6 a.m. Well, why not? Because he starts at 8 or 9. Because he gots to get his kids ready for school. 
Seoul. Seoul. Seoul, if you will. South Korea. Why not? If they want to learn Korean, then all the power to them, because I understand that it's a difficult language to learn. Cool, cool, cool. Water! Jordan says on Sundays it's fairly manageable no matter what because of the extra two hours of no customers. Yeah, that would help. It, yeah, definitely. I still think it's kind of dumb that you have to... Oh, right. That you have to, oh, right? Yeah. During the school year, Monday to Thursday is usually fine. Says the Jordan. Excellent. Oh, is this when their heads start turning into tangling monsters? Yeah. But yeah, like I was saying, I, I, I still think it's kind of dumb that you have to be there at 6 a.m. even on Sundays when we don't open until 9. I mean, the extra several hey. hours is probably helpful. Those are very long. Wow. Uh -huh. There we go, jeez. What do you want in there, bud? Uh, probably food, if I had to guess. But there's no food in the recycle bin. I failed to see your point. My cat's a ding-dong. But is he a bing-bong? All hail the sauntering spaghetti monster. <laughs> Don't those things die immediately to a flash grenade, Kite asks? They do, yes. I just... I didn't think uh, using using one of my flash grenades on one of them would have been uh, an efficient use. Hey, Wonton, you're not going to fit into the empty litter box. A body has been discovered! Yay? Just saying, I'm. if I can ever find an affordable copy of that game, it is getting streamed. What's that? Danganronpa. Ah. What, baby? What are you doing? Whole series one was on sale on PSN about a month ago. Well, uh, that's unfortunate. But I assume you wanted. I I would probably rather do physical. It depends on. Oh, hi, hi there, axe, almost in my face. Is there? Where's the dude? There's right the there. dude. I found him. Remember when we were Man, playing Resident guy. Evil Six and? Uh, yeah. Hi. I don't know why, but this bit kind of reminds me of the little graveyard that we're running around at the beginning. Oh, that guy died. Yes. How? I shot him once. Uh, I guess he also fell out of a building, but that draw? doesn't usually kill people in this game. I'll say like in real life, or... Spinelli. But yeah, I, I would like to do physical if it's possible to find. sure how much those games go for. Uh, I checked Amazon for them as recently as yesterday, and I don't remember if it was the trilogy or if it was just one and two, but uh, it was, I think, like 400 and something. Can confirm. Plus 4838 shipping. Yeah. Sorry, that. import fees and free shipping. Free? Shipping. Uh, or $601.50 with free shipping! Oh boy! And it's the trilogy. Just get a PSTV. Um, 
I feel like those also go for a, a pretty penny, plus I would have to get the actual games for, uh, for Vita as well. Plus I already have a Vita itself, so uh, I don't know if that would be considered a waste of money or not. A PlayStation TV on Amazon.ca is selling for $245. Okay. Which is less than 400 and some? That is how math works, yes. Hmm. Speaking of expensive stuff, have you seen the price for the P5 Take Your Heart Limited Edition? Uh... I haven't. I know it's, like, super, super limited. Like, Donnie pre-ordered it and he almost didn't get it. Well, Donnie's the one who asked. Oh. No, I, I, I thought that was... I thought you had seen a copy on Amazon, and I was like, what? No, no, I'm oh, sorry, I was reading a comment, I should have, uh, specified. My bad. Yeah, if, if I have to, I might, I'll probably end up going digital. If I must. Well, I mean, that's kind of how you decided to go for the other Persona games, because, like, ha <laughs> money. Yeah. Specifically, two. Yeah. And the other two. Yeah. I... For Valentine's Day, we, we usually do, like, a pretty low limit, like, let's go on a date kind of deal, like, go get coffee and cheesecake. This year I got him a gift card for an amount for the PSN, and I was just like, hello, this is specifically for Persona. <laughs> specifically for Persona 2, or... Wasn't or it, Persona like, Persona 2, 2 or, a, or another thing? Maybe? I can only oh, remember God. Persona. Uh, Alright, I'd asked if you'd wanted hello, friends. Uh, an eShop card for something else. Right. Hmm. Oh, that guy lit himself on fire. That's cool. I have a copy of the Danganronpa trilogy that I found for like $45 recently. I already beat all the games on Vita. I just bought it for collecting. I can let you borrow it, says Andrew. I think Nicholas would like a uh, copy to call his own. Eventually, anyway. Because yeah, he is also a collector. I'm I'm also somewhat of a collector, which is why I prefer to have them physical, but Oh god! They evaporated. They're good at that. Well, that guy's head exploded. The other one lit himself on fire. I mean, that's good for you. Very good for me, yes. Uh, 